Hey everyone, this was a big week for Dota 2. Valve announced the invitees to this year's International, and some of the invites were a bit surprising. But remember, Valve always prioritized stability over anything else. Winning certainly helps. The first team invited is none other than the previous champion, Team Spirit. They will have a chance to repeat with the same roster, with Yotoro, Lauro, Collapse, Mira, and Miposhka. From China, Extreme Gaming will be led by Ame, XM, XXS, ShinQ, and DY. The third team, by far the most successful this year, is Team Falcons, Skitter, Maureen, ATF, Crit, and Snake King. The next few are a bit of a surprise, considering they haven't won a tournament this year or as good as the top three invitees. Team Liquid will bring Mickey, 33, Boxy, and Insania. Last year's best team, Game and Gladiators, will be heading back with the same roster that Raichio, Quinn, Ace, Tofu, and Celery. And the last invite comes from Eastern Europe, Bet Boon Team, Nightfall, GBK, Miro, Save, and Toronto Tokyo. The qualifiers for the international kicks off on June 9th, so any results from the Esports World Cup in Ria will make no difference. China and North America qualifiers will begin from June 9th to the 13th. China will have two slots and North America will have one slot. Eastern Europe and South America will be from June 14th to the 18th. Eastern Europe will have one slot and South America will have two slots. And following that will be the final two regions, Western Europe and Southeast Asia. Both regions will receive two slots for the international. The open qualifiers are set to begin from June 3rd to the 8th. Valve also announced some important dates for the event and when the tickets will go on sale. September 4th will mark the start of the group stages. Following that, there will be a 5-day playoff period that will run through till September 10th. The International will feature the top 8 teams starting on Friday, September 13th to the 15th. Tickets to the International will be available on Monday, June 10th, so mark your calendars. Back to the present with the Esports World Cup qualifiers going on for a spot at the $5 million prize pool at RIA Masters. Shopify Rebellion made their decision and welcomes Ivan, Mind Control, Ivanov. Nouns make an improbable comeback and snatches the ticket to the React Master from Shopify Rebellion. No pause, like you said, quite good at dealing with the CK on this high ground push. The call comes in, Gunner's found him, Yopaz is just dead. It is unbelievable, wicked six spree for Gunner, looking for a scam as well. He needs to be careful, he's in kinda deep. Does have a lot of armor, needs some help. The rest of the team just stunned on the backside with the four staff to get him to safety. Great hook shot in from Skem Poppy. Still plenty healthy. Yuma turning his attention on over the clockwork. He's dead. That is a dieback as Copy still has an Aegis to work with. The Parasma coming off cooldown. There's the call from Gunner. And it looks like Nouns might be doing it. Sending Shopify packing. Three dead with no buyback. And a 32 thousand gold advantage at 35 minutes cracking the base max has 82 percent physical damage resistance when he uses call when you pop bkb with that he has a chance in eastern europe virtus pro punched their ticket to react with a 3-0 victory over navi in china g2 ig takes the first of three spot by defeating kev and in southeast asia aurora and blacklist international will represent that region Here's Blacklist celebrating their victory. PGL announced Season 2 at Wallachia and it will begin in October 1st to the 13th. It will be the first major tournament following the International. It will once again be a $1 million prize pool tournament. The qualifiers will be from August 9th to the 17th. This will be awkward for teams making changes post the International. There will be 16 teams competing. Speaking of PGL, they have copyrighted a few clips. That's why a couple of videos are gone. We're trying to get that fixed. It's unfortunate they're trying to kill the preservation of Dota news. Fissure Universe 2 also happened this week. NTT claimed victory over OG with a 3-1 victory. This tournament had a lot of surprises. Here's NTT's winning moment. Weaver is on me. He's a level ahead of me. No, wait, that is a support. He gets a nice tornado off. Cold snap, deafening blast, DP away. Spirit Vessel will kill him. Stolen Shikuchi, Sap dropping low as well. There will be a uh, slow on DM for a second, but Fishman, he's not going to be the low being slow. 
Double down, gets itself a double. Soul bind was used. No one is dropping low. Lifted up in the air. A couple more hits from the Ursa should finish him off. But the Ursa will die before that happens. And OG, they finally had enough. The last game of the tournament will also be the shortest game of the tournament here Bowie 16 minutes and 36 seconds that is how much OG made it through in this game four of the best of five grand finals well that's all for this week thanks for watching check back next week for the international news like share and subscribe